Hi, welcome back to our YouTube channel. This is Balakrishna. So in this video, I am going to explain differential equations, important seven mark questions for IP. Okay, enter 1B. Okay, so here first one. If square root of 1 minus x square plus square root of 1 minus y square is equal to a of x minus y, then prove that dy by dx is equal to square root of 1 minus y square by square root of 1 minus x square. So these questions are important. Uh, it is compulsory getting in IP exams. Okay. So how we can do that? And let us take given square root 1 minus x square plus square root 1 minus y square is equal to a of x minus y. So for this problem, we can take that. Let us take x is equal to sin alpha, y is equal to sin beta, y is equal to sin beta. So, these two values you can substitute here. So, here square root of 1 minus sin square alpha plus x square means sin alpha whole square, nothing but sin square alpha. So, square root 1 minus sin square beta is equal to a of sin alpha minus sin beta. So, here 1 minus sin square alpha. So, here by using trigonometric identities. So, what the trigonometric identity is? Sin square alpha plus cos square alpha is equal to 1. So, plus sin square alpha is going to solve the pen minus. So, here cos square alpha is equal to 1 minus sin square alpha. Same cos square beta is also 1 minus sin square beta. So, in the place of 1 minus sin square alpha, we can write as cos square alpha. In the place of 1 minus sin square beta, we can write as cos square beta. So, here we can write as cos square alpha plus square root of cos square beta. So, is equal to a of sin alpha minus sin beta. So, square, square root cancel, square, square root cancel. So, cos alpha plus cos beta is equal to a of sin alpha minus sin beta. So, this multiple come to left side of the pen divide. So, cos alpha plus cos beta by sin alpha minus sin beta is equal to a. So, it is in the form of in numerator it is in the form of cos c plus cos d. So, cos c plus cos d is equal to cos of c plus d by 2 cos c minus d by 2. So, next sin c plus sin, sin c minus sin d. Sin c minus sin d is equal to 2 cos of c plus d by 2 sin of c minus d by 2 sin of c minus d by 2. So, in the place of c here alpha, in the place of d here beta. So, we can write as cos c, okay, cos c plus cos d. What the formula? 2 cos of c plus d by 2 cos c minus d by 2. So, that is a 2 cos of alpha plus beta by 2 into cos of alpha minus beta by 2 by here 2 cos of alpha plus beta by 2 into sin of alpha minus beta by 2 is equal a. So, 2 to cancel. So, no matter denominator what is the common cos alpha plus beta by 2 cos alpha plus beta by 2 both are cancel. So, what is the remaining? What is the remaining cos alpha minus beta by 2 sin alpha minus beta by 2 is equal to a. So, cos by sin, what is the ratio? Cot ratio. So, cot alpha minus beta by 2 is equal to a. So, cot divide cot here cot alpha plus beta by 2. So, we can write as alpha minus beta by 2 is equal to cot inverse A. Cot inverse A. So, here alpha nothing but what? Okay. So, x is equal to sin alpha. X is equal to sin alpha. From this, we can write as alpha is equal to 
alpha is equal sin inverse x beta is equal sin inverse y so in the place of alpha we can add as sin inverse x in the place of beta we can add as sin inverse y so here 1 by 2 of sin inverse x minus sin inverse y is equal cot inverse a cot inverse a so here how we can do that derivative with respect to x derivative with respect to x so here 2 divide one raised divided by multiple so sin inverse x minus sin inverse y is equal to cot inverse a so here we can do that derivative with respect to x okay then d by dx of sin inverse x minus sin inverse y is equal d by dx of 2 cot inverse a so the derivative for both two terms so derivative of sin inverse x so d by dx of sin inverse x minus d by dx of sin inverse y so derivative of constant 2 cot inverse a nothing but it is a constant derivative of constant is how much 0 so next d by dx of sin in inverse x what the formula 1 by square root of 1 minus x square minus d by dx of sin inverse y so 1 by square root of 1 minus y square here derivative with x so here what is the y so that is derivative dy by dx is equal to 0 so here this minus term going to isolate upon plus so 1 by square root 1 minus x square is equal 1 by square root 1 minus y square is equal to divided by dx so here it is divided going to left side upon multiple so that is 1 by square root 1 minus x square into so square root 1 minus y square is equal to divided by dx so from this we can write as divided by dx is equal square root 1 minus y square by square root 1 minus x square so here what is asking that prove that divided by dx is equal square root of 1 minus y square by square root of 1 minus x square thank you for watching my videos please subscribe our youtube channel and share to your friends thank you